Hello Libras! So this is your official monthly reading. So for this um, video, I will have different categories. I'm going to start it off with general message, then I'm going to go to love. Um, after that, I'm going to go to career, finance, and work. And um, for the last part of the reading, I'm going to do family and friends as well too. So let's see what the general message is. Oh, universe, give me a four card spread. So there's king, there is engineer. Okay, we've got other cards here there's advocate, rebel, Midas, and miser. Okay, I feel like this is your energy. I feel like you guys are, um, you guys are, you guys are like basically really extremely focused on your goals. Okay, um, you're trying to see like how can you get to the next level, okay, um, hit another milestone, okay, I see that, and I feel like with the rebel, I feel like you're doing things that you typically won't do, but you know if you do it, it's going to lead to great rewards, it's going to, um, it's going to make you feel like, you're already that me, <laughs> but it's going to make you feel like that king, that queen, basically, so I feel like a lot of you guys are really pursuing your dreams, which is amazing, that's really good, so, Continue to be in that energy. Now, I do got beggar here, so I'm going to see what, what this is about. Universe, clarify beggar. Father and child orphan. Oh, okay. Some of you guys, um, they might be some things that's triggering you at this moment while you are um, persevering, while you are working on your goals. Um it could be like some family issue. Let's just say you didn't have a father growing up that, that, you know, that energy might trigger again during the holidays. Um, or you don't have a good relationship with your father, particularly, it could be a mother too as well. Um, but I feel like what he's trying to say is that everything happened for a reason. Um, it's hard to forgive somebody who did you wrong, but it's the best thing because it's going to let go of that weight, that heavy energy. Okay. So let's look at the other spread. Yes. See. So there is indecision, gratitude, universe, give me two more cards. There's imagination and regret. Okay. Jenna energy is grief. Okay. Yeah. So I feel like there's going to be some things that might be triggering you in the month of December. Okay. But again, I feel like the universe wants you to look at it at half full instead of half empty. Okay. Everything happens for a reason, okay? You want to be who you are today if um, you didn't experience certain things, okay? So everything really happens for a reason. So don't get too caught up with that. Look at things half full, okay? Let's see. Let's look at love. Okay, universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen in Libra's love life? So there's trust. Universe can meet through my cards. Universe can meet through my cards. Um, there's forgiving and learning. Universe can meet through my cards. Okay, children and let go of control issues. Flirt. Yes, okay. Trust. So here is picking up on both energies, single and couple. Universe, give me a four card spread. Imprisonment. So imprisonment, message, occupation, toil, labor, death, and journey. Yeah, see? Yeah, this is it go, it's going back to general message again. So it's like you guys having enough of doing things that you would not like to do, but you do it because it's comfortable for you. I feel like a lot of you guys are really stepping out of your comfort zone and really pursuing your dreams, okay? Aries had a similar message, but it was showing that they was not really acting upon it just yet. And I noticed with opposite signs, they tend to go through similar things. 
um, around the same time. So I see you guys really acting upon your dreams, your pursuits, okay? You're really putting action to it, okay? You're getting out of your comfort zone. You, you know, things that used to be comfortable for you is not comfortable for you no more. And you're really pursuing it. At the same time, you are, um, things might be triggering you at the same time, but it's like you guys are pushing forward. And I feel like a lot of you guys might take this opportunity when things are, you know, flashbacks, triggers, you're going to take that time to heal from that. Okay. At the same time. So it's picking up on general. Let me see the tarot because it's all about you basically. <laughs> Let's look here. Okay, so universe, give me a five card spread. What's going to happen in Libra's love life for December 2021? Okay, so I see a fire sign, particularly a Sagittarius, want to reconnect with you. Okay, then I see family again, childhood, a lot of these things here. Um, Hierophant, you being committed, and then also Ten of Wands in reverse. No beef, Seven of Pentacles. Okay, yeah, someone want to want to reconcile with you, Libra. Let's see what this is about. Four of cups and the three of cups. Yeah, someone want to reconcile with you. You might reject them. Universe cover of four of cups and the three of cups. Lovers in reverse. They make a final decision to be with you. Universe cover of lovers in reverse. Yep, emperor. Especially if it's a fire sign, okay? Universe clarify the seven pentacles. Universe cover by seven of pentacles, the tower. Yep, you're waiting for your ships to come through, basically. And it's going to happen. I feel like it might happen. It probably already happened since I have Scorpio here. Or it's going to happen, like, within two months. Okay, so January, February. Universe clarify the tower. Universe clarify the tower. Temperance universe, three of pentacles universe. Yeah. So I feel like whatever you've been putting your all into is going to manifest unexpectedly but also there was like an unexpected um change as well too um with that tower some of you guys really had enough of like being in the safe zone being in a comfort zone and you're really stepping out your box okay universe clarify the ten of wands in reverse i got a lot of cards three i mean two of wands judgment the moon in reverse nine of wands in reverse three of swords in reverse again reconciliation um also it could be a father figure that's trying to reconcile with you someone who was not in your life or wasn't really a good father to you um they want to reconcile with you universe clever the hierophant 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 you got the two of cups ten of pentacles beautiful ace of pentacles in verse yeah so someone who missed opportunity with you they want to resurface okay universe magician okay probably this is something that you wanted before some of you guys don't want it anymore but whatever you wanted before is coming back okay it's um it's manifesting now universe clarify the king of wands in reverse universe clarify the king of wands in reverse seven of swords in reverse yeah this is someone who's very selfish very inconsiderate but now they want to show you that they mature that they're the emperor not the king of wands in reverse Okay, so I see like a fire sign X definitely coming back to you. Okay, um, they're trying to show you that they have changed, and I feel like they are serious this time, they went through something, but a lot of you guys don't even want this somewhere, you know. <laughs> Sometimes it's like that you, you manifested something and you want it at a certain time, and then it, 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 it came through later, and then like, I don't want this, I don't want this anymore. So it could be like that too for you guys. But I see something great. It's going to come about. Um, and I feel like it's more so of you. Like you pursuing your passion, your goals, your dreams. Okay. So let's see. Let's see what's going on. Universe, we have four cards spread. So there is the double. <laughs> then there is emotional withdrawal. 
Three of Swords. That's a lot of cards. Material, spiritual, prosperity, firm foundation, obstacle and challenges, harmony, and rest and rejuvenate. Okay, moving on. Yeah, this is about healing things. That was really like preventing you from getting to the highest potential. You are conquering any demons, okay? Inner demons, people that were serving as antagonists in your life, you're you're really conquering them, you're slaying them away. Okay. Um, I feel like someone is wanting to make amends with you. Okay. The, the one I feel like this is someone who's very selfish. That person want to make amends with you. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. So universe, give me a four card spread. There's a situation will improve. Commun communicate clearly. Then there is no, <laughs> then there is no need to worry. Abundance. Yeah. So yeah, this person is going to come back, um, for, uh, like asking for your forgiveness. Okay. You might forgive this person. Um, it's best to forgive. Okay. So you don't have that heavy energy. Um, some of you guys are not, <laughs> but I feel like the no, it's more so like, it's like you forgive them, but you're on a different path. Okay. Um, you're on a path of abundance. Okay. So that's what I'm saying. Okay, now let's look at the Oracle, and then I'm going to go to the Career Work Finance reading. Okay, so. Okay, Universe, give me a two-card spread. What messages do you have for Libra? Some of you guys are going to meet a new Taurus. Okay, that's a random message, but <laughs> I was getting that. Universe, give me two more cards. Yes, I knew it was going to be a friend. Yeah, I feel like you're going to be a new Taurus friend, okay? So, friendship. I'm deeply grateful for g the gift of friends, and my appreciation for them is endless. Soul's journey. I listen to my soul's simple truth and allow my life to unfold naturally, okay? Then, inner wellspring. This card kind of reminds me of the Empress. This is your energy, too. I have an inner wellspring of love that luxuriously overflows with abundance, okay? So, let's look at career work and find out. All right, so let's see. How will finances be for Libra in December 2021? Okay, we got the King of Wands. Oh, okay. It became weird. Okay, King of Wands in verse, Ten of Wands in verse. Okay. So this could be what's going to be the catalyst to push you out of your comfort zone, okay? Um, finance, King of Wands in verse, Ten of Wands in verse. I feel like this is you getting tired of the same old, same old. Okay, so I feel like there is going to be a catalyst, but this catalyst is good. It's going to um, push you to get to that next level, push you to get out of your comfort zone. So finances might be like a little bit rocky, but I feel like it's going to serve as a catalyst. Okay, so universe, how will work will be for Libra? Okay, these cards want to come out. Three of Swords, Nine of Wands. Yeah, so the universe wants you to change something. I feel like the universe wants you to do what you need to do, basically. Um, getting out that comfort zone. So whatever, if it's resonating, whatever is changing, let it change because it's really serving as a catalyst for your growth, basically, okay? Um, universe, what does Libra need to watch out for at work in December through wands? So waiting for your ships to come. So this is a good thing. So what you need to watch out for is like positivity. It's nothing negative. It's like, I'm not seeing that. So if something is changing, if if you're leaving something, it's for a reason. Don't see it as a negative thing, okay? Do not because it's really going to lead to opportunity to grow, okay? Um, to hit a, another milestone, to accomplish um, another goal, okay, with that three wands. So universe, what can... What can Libra do? What should Libra do to exceed at work in December? The Magician, Ace of Pentacles, and a Two of Wands, okay? So first manifest, but also put action towards it. And I see you guys are going to do that, okay? Because I feel like you're tired of the same one and you're really, really going to push yourself, okay? So what you need to do is basically visualize, manifest, and put an action towards it, okay? I see you getting tired of the same one. Ten of Swords, okay. Now let's look at the Oracle notes. Let's see what's going on. Okay, 
And these cards just want to fly. Let's see what these cards was about. I'm going to stop these messages for you guys. So there's Gatekeeper, Network, Negative Gatekeeper, Business Owners. Are you using ads? What type of ads? Okay, so I'm going to talk about this briefly. Um, You might have like a Negative Manager, okay, or a Director, or someone who's like... um in a higher position okay um okay so like i was trying to say um you might have someone who's like a negative manager someone who's in like um in a higher position um this is someone who i feel like is threatened by you now for the business owners libras i feel like what the universe wants you to do is kind of shake um change your marketing okay um try to implement different um marketing different ads even if you have like just say your business is relating to sales getting influencers see like how it can um inf how it can um improve your business so you see what else i'm getting hey okay, universe give me a four card spread It's going to be a four card spread. What's going to what's going to happen in Libras for Libras in December 2021? Universe, what's going to happen for Libras for December? Okay, so Jenna energy is money increasing. Invest more into your business, time, energy, finances, and quality. Yep. So whatever that needs to change is because the universe wants you to focus on what you really want to do. Okay. Let me fix that lighting. The lighting look crazy. Okay. <laughs> have you been um, Have you been connecting with the right people? Okay. So just network. I did saw the network card earlier. Um, actually ask what you want. And that's going back to the tarot where you're trying to show the magician. Okay. So you, you do need to manifest. You need to visualize. You need to believe. Okay. Then it is work on your confidence. Yeah. And I feel like it's more believing that you can accomplish those things. Okay. Like the universe want what's best for you. Okay. And everybody don't limit yourself. Don't limit God. Cause when you limit yourself, you limit God, what, what God can do for you. So the universe wants you to think dream big and actually pursue it too okay so yes look at family and friends to see what's going on with that okay so universe give me a four card spread what's going to happen with libra's family and friends in december 2021 okay we got a lot of cards here my income is constantly increasing sacrifice rest and rejuvenate Okay, justice, your energy, the fool. Yep, you're beginning something new that's going to lead to a lot of money. The higher set. The line between opposite extremes. I mean, the middle way between opposite. Okay, the middle way. The line between opposite extremes. Okay. Universe, give me one more card. Judgment and ten of cups. Yeah, so I feel like with family member, there's one family member. It could be a father figure or a mother. Um who want you to forgive them, okay? They want to rebuild this connection, relationship with you, okay? Um, family looking good, okay? I feel like friends, um, they're supporting you, especially if you have something new, like you're doing something new, um, you have a new business, or you're going back to school. They're really supporting you. They're being there for you when um, when you need them. And also, like, let's just say you're very busy. They understand you. They're not going to have a problem, Okay. So I see family and friends looking good, okay? Especially with family. I feel like relationship is getting better with family, okay? So that's the reading that I have for you, Libras. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a person with me at queenfittertarot at gmail.com.